Ma quanto siamo belle queste bambine, le nanina, le nanina, le nanina, le pappardelle, a ragù, a ragù, le nanina, le pappardelle, le nanina, le pina, un piero di nanina, e fetto di nanina. Ecco! Ma salute! Gesundheit! Bless you! Mama! Mama! You're coming! E... Muovi la culetta, culetta, culetta! Muovi la culetta, pu, pu, pu! Muovi la culetta, culetta, culetta! Muovi la culetta, pu, pu, pu! Muovi la culetta, culetta, culetta! Muovi la culetta, pu, pu, pu! Ciao ragazzi! Ciao ragazzi! Okay. My hair is cut, but... With your hair, we need two cameras to film on the entire... We are talking about the fact that we are not really married. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, I don't know if, you, if I want to say we are not really married, but I want to put it that we are not yet officially married. And finding out that we are not married was really a lot of a shock to say the least. It was just shocking. For you. Oh, for you, you kind of knew already all along. Oh, I was like, oh. And there is a fox. Volpe. 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 You, oh, oh, you're pulling on Mama's pulley. Yeah, my Volpe. Oh, this is God for your magic. Oh. So, probably she thinks that you're also Volpe. Here we are. Just uh, embarrassing. Don't look at me, it's not my fault. <laughs> and it's nobody's fault. Ah, okay, maybe we are to fall for both of us that we are responsible for no, actually, you know, we took the decision to do what we did and yeah, here we are. Anyways, so let me start by saying we have been and we are still happily married for, let's see, how long? 2017, 2021, so four years now. Yes. In September would be four years. We have had a beautiful wedding with all our family. A beautiful celebration. Please, can you let the thingy camera a little me as a person? Ah, otherwise she does not. No, it has got to a white person. Great. Go, go to the other side. <laughs> yes. So we have had a beautiful wedding. Everything has been amazing. Was amazing, especially the celebration. I mean, throughout we considered each other. We consider each other also husband and wife. Maybe not a lot, but at least as married couple. Yeah, in, your, in your mind, I do consider you my wife. I always referring to you, my no, wife, my wife. No, it's not true. You don't refer to me as my wife. When do you refer to me as my wife? Yeah. When you're on the phone. Oh, the babysitter, for example. Yeah, yeah before the baby? Before the baby. Yeah, you. So since three months ago, I'm your wife now. No, we were just lampy. No, yeah, we exactly. Since three months ago, probably those things are the reason why we are not married yet. Yeah, so let me put it this way. For me, it was a little bit crazy. I should have known this was coming, but it just never clicked my mind that we might end up in this position. So when I was at the hospital mm -hmm. two days before the cesarean section and they were asking me some questions, the questions were strange, but mm -hmm. I didn't click in my mind like, oh, maybe they are doubting that I'm married or something. Mm -hmm. The lady said to me, oh, ah, that's why you are wearing your ring now. Because I feel like now I need to prove all the time that I'm married. That is the first ring uh, the, that we that we had. But that is not even the, the, ring, the ring that we used for the wedding. Yeah, but it's, it's the ring. That indicate. So you feel like if I'm walking around like this, you know, no, she's not married. That's not the ring for the marriage. I have no idea. Baby, when I have this on, I'm officially married. Oh, no, not oh. And when you don't have it, you are free? Oh, what are you saying? Uh, yeah. Ooh. Not, baby, not what you're <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Let's see in the comment section what is going to be written. So, when you don't have the ring, you consider you free and available. No. Single and ready to mingle. When I went to the hospital and I had to do some documentation, just uh, 
it was uh, there were several questions regarding yeah I'm already here we are several questions regarding who who is going to join me during the birth process and so on and I was like oh my my husband is coming with me yeah. they say the person you are married to is not the father of the child oh. right like you know like a direct already in this direction like you have cheaters <laughs> So no, I was I like, when that. she getting this information, it's like, no, of, of course it's the is, is, you know, of course it's the person that I'm married to. And I remember the, after the baby was born, and we were doing all the documentation to to apply for the birth certificate. Yes, I'm married when you were born. When you were born, uh, the lady came to us and say, uh, we need a father father shaft and and a mm -hmm. And this is, I don't know how to say it in English, but this is like a recognition that you're a father mm -hmm. and this is usually if you're not, if you're not married. Mm -hmm. And I will say to her, no, we are married. Mm -hmm. But probably still it was strange that my son is, I don't know, just there were, somehow it was obvious to the nurses that we are probably not married. Sorry. We got legally married in Copenhagen. Why we did that? because we went to the German administration, the German office in our small town where we were living at the time and we asked how do we get married in Germany and what do we need? And we got a ex really complicated explanation of all the certificate, all the translation we needed to have of this certificate that needed to be submitted, probably we, we, went, we were going to be waiting six months before we get uh, approved to get married and then after that we have to book a date to get married that was going to take another probably six months or something like that so we went online and we looked at a solution and we discovered that in Denmark once you you can get married really easily you just need the passport basically and if, and uh, your declaration that you are a single you are not you haven't been married before and that's it basically. When we came back here in Germany, what we did, we went to the administration here and we tried to submit that our document. And they said, okay, no problem, we submitted your document. But they never told us that we needed one document to certify the fact that you are not married already in the media. And that's what caused all of the problems that we have going through in the past three months since Olivia was born. When we registered this in Germany, accepted right away and immediately we got the tax number as a married couple. Yeah, that is the most absurd thing. <laughs> yes, yes. And, and a new document from the city administration that says we are a married couple. Yeah. Now, we are four years later, we got a baby, and we are being told, no, you, you are not, not married. Legally yes. married. And you're, oh, no, it's not that you're not legally married, but our marriage is not recognized here in Germany, which is the place where we are living since 2015, even before then, and that since we got married in Copenhagen, we have been paying taxes here as a married couple. And all other benefits as a married couple. And this, you know, uh, certificate from the city administration that we are married. But then when we got a child, they said, no, you are not married. Yeah. And we submitted our document, which was already accepted then, and they said, yeah, we have the document, but this is irrelevant until we are only going to approve and accept that you are married. Once I verify that uh, I was not married in Namibia. If you are registered as a married couple, basically, and you are paying taxes as a married, married couple, couple, you still need to prove, prove later to prove on that you are married and you are the father of the child. Yes. Exactly. Four years so, later. Oops, 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 oops. Contractions. Baby number two is on the way. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah so. Me finding out, I was frustrated. I remember that day when we fed, when you you called first and you were told, and I was like, no, that cannot be, that's not serious. Like we have been here for four years, they have been in the taxes. same area <laughs> and paying the, the tax. You know, it's always married couple. And I called them and I was really frustrated. Also because we are married, we are living together. There was COVID. We are together. I'm thinking now, why would they say you're not the father of the child? Yeah, it's crazy. But I have. Um, a feeling if my surname was already the same as your surname, it would have been obvious 
that mm -hmm. probably were married. But yeah. because I didn't have that, was probably very, very suspicious, plus not wearing the ring. Yeah, but it's kind of crazy. Like, how would you... I know, it's not that we don't have any documentation of the fact that we got married. We had a full certification from the authorities, Denmark authorities, with the, uh, with the certified translation in, in, in the German language, and we submitted that, and that has been registered since 2017 and, uh, on the German uh, administration. So now that we got Olivia, they came up with this fact that, like, no, your marriage is not valid because we don't know if your wife was previously married in Amelia. No, yeah, but you know, that it, it's not only that, it's really like, uh, why would you accept it right away when it's, you are earning money from our salary? Yeah, because obviously for the tax. Yeah. But then for this, they, I just, this was really weird. Yeah. Could be also discrimination. Oh, yeah. Really yeah. You best. Mm -hmm. But yeah, me finding out I was a little, I was very frustrated because um, mm. I thought of you as uh, somebody who's always as a father. I thought of you as a father who is fully devoted to the child, mm -hmm. and how you feel uh, being informed that you're not the father. I mean, just not only that, we're in, in quarantine. I have to be honest. I was like uh, a little bit. I, I thought that I was going to feel that way, but when I saw the 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 pre birth the, the, yeah, the pre certificate, she had to register Olivia on her own so name. name. So I saw. Olivia, your surname, and I said, "Oh, that is going to be a lot of be a lot of stress later on." At certain point, I feel like maybe that could be a chance for us to do a third wedding. Oh, in Namibia, though. Yeah, well, and, and really get. Married. I want to do it, uh, a wedding, not a marriage. Uh, so no a wedding, like a party, and really celebrate once we. Absolutely, we have no Olivia. Flower girl is here. Flower girl is here. You are going to be. Here. Oops. You know, he's playing music. Alu flower, a kundu. <laughs> <laughs> no, a uh, fresh a kundu. Uh -huh. Ooh. Okay, she should be wearing like the Oshibamba dress in pink because those red flowers are going to stain her dress like crazy. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, the, the, the pink men, they leave pink men on your I think they leave a pink men on your hands. No problem. Yeah, so, yeah, that's what we have been dealing with. I mean, we, are, we have been dealing with a couple of things, but that's one of those. And a couple, just <laughs> a lot of things, but yeah, one of those that it was um, disappointing and weird because I have a feeling if it was not during quarantine, maybe you would think like, oh, maybe the judge said, you know, my, but I think in this case, you were just like, oh, so you would be stuck in this apartment forever. No, if you have found this video informative, I would say, please give us a like, subscribe if you haven't done that yet and leave us a comment down below because that is going to help us because maybe you can share your experience with this kind of problem and help the audience that is going through or they want to get married they are maybe also a mixed couple so they go through this kind of problem or they are living in germany so they know these things in advance i would just say if you're living here maybe take a sh do not take a shortcut because it might be rejected we just didn't want to do the documentation because it was crazy but in the end here we are we so still we, we still, story. you still, it doesn't matter how, in a way, on the other, before and after, you are going to get through the general administration <laughs> if you're living in this country. There is no way out. I'm sorry. That's it for today's video, guys. Bye, bye, bye. Ciao.